Hi everyone. I'm um, not gonna lie, this is my third attempt to to record this video. Uh, the first one I misset the GoPro. The second one I don't know what happened. The third one it's uh, is now. Uh, in the meantime, I even lost this GoPro. I <laughs> I had to spend an hour to 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 uh, to find it but uh, the reason for for this video is uh, here here's my new dirt bike i got myself a honda 300l um yeah i just picked it up a couple of days ago and uh, well <laughs> it's been a difficult journey I don't know since what the hell was it since the moment I uh, I went to the dealership uh, ship it was difficult um, that's why I don't have any more content that's why it took me a couple of days to record this video uh, yeah but in the meantime I did like 50 kilometers on it 52 even I managed to fall once on a sand um, but other than this I'm exploring this bike so for those of you who follow my channel you know that I've been I've been what I've been doing with my TRK you know that uh, sooner or later it had to happen that I I I I get a dirt bike so it happened and uh, this is the only obvious choice um at least for me uh there there was no better choice than this uh, crf 300l for a brief moment i considered the 300 rally as an option but then i would end up with basically two adventure like motorcycles having in mind that the rally is still more off-road oriented than the trk still they would serve similar purpose so i i went with the they call it the standard version 300l and yeah now i have two bikes so i reinstalled uh, the central stand on my on my trk and i'm uh, i i um, i will be using that bike for for longer trips for fun uh this is my uh this is my toy so um yes as i said i did 50 kilometers on the bike uh first impressions <laughs> very different uh so much lighter so much lighter it feels like i'm on a bicycle compared to the trk and only when i uh tried this motorcycle i realized how massive trk is how big of a bike that is and how heavy it is because when i switched back and forth uh, to this one damn the trk feels massive and it feels like a tank compared to this one where this one is is very nimble is very light it's very easy to to handle although i expected it will uh, i expected it will make me a, a dirt bike rider like that uh, that's not what happened it still requires some skills i'm just trying to figure out and adapt how should i ride on a lighter bike with uh, more knobby tires but yeah it's 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 a bit different it's a bit easier in some areas in some areas it's not that easy um yeah but uh, it's a new experience life's short so here's my new bike and here's something new that i will try to achieve it so yeah i consider myself a dirt bike noob i've never even uh, sat down on a uh, on a real dirt bike I'm, I'm i'm assuming that this meets the criteria for a real dirt bike so yeah and the first time i i rode on one it was in this one so zero experience so for those of you who who think that maybe their bikes are interesting uh but never tried them well i hope that my future videos will answer you some basic questions uh, if uh, a dirt bike is is for you but regarding this piece of metal um yeah i mean they it's considered a budget bike uh, although I would love to uh, say otherwise, it's a budget bike. 
I mean, there are items that are so budget, it's just, they look so cheap. For example, these bags, I mean, TRK bags are amazing compared to these ones, like this lever. Uh, can you even go cheaper than this this one come on i will i will do a compare video but this is as i mean i'm I'm not saying that this is needed here this is not a bike for two adults for sure not but this is so cheap i mean but or this i don't want to complain about it but those indicators come on they remember second world war come on honda please I don't even, I'm not gonna even mention about the, the headlamp, so yeah, I mean, uh, there's plenty of uh, aftermarket stuff that you can put on the bike. I'm not a fan of, of investing in aftermarket stuff, but I mean, there's no other way. I, I, I mean, I, I just want to have a proper pegs uh, to do a proper off-road. These bulbs, like, look at the size of this. This is like... I don't know, way too much. I, I, you can do better. And something that I was really surprised about, I was pretty sure that it will have a USB somewhere in here, but it seems that it, it, it only, it's only applicable to the ra rally. Um, in terms of riding quickly, well, it's very different. So, I don't know. Um, there's a lot of complaint about the suspension. I'm 85 kilos, maybe with the gear closer to to 90. I mean, I cannot complain. Uh, I haven't adjusted it uh, a bit. I mean, I haven't adjusted it at all. And it's okay. I mean, <laughs> I, I haven't uh, figured out uh, how to push it to its limit. And for me, at the moment, it's okay. I, I mean, the pressure on, on, on changing things immediately with those dirt bikes is, is, is just tremendous. So... I'm gonna try to to see if it's possible to stick with some uh, uh, stock stuff without replacing everything. So uh, one of my goals. Uh, other than this, this um, I would love to have a nice deco to have it a bit different than others. Maybe maybe I'll find something. Not a super fan of this red everywhere, but yeah, this is Honda, so you get a red bike. Um, what else is there? I guess it's, I guess uh, that's it. I mean, here I rode here and I scratched it. I don't know if the the paint is so thin. I I, I don't know. I don't even know how did that happen. Is it from my sh boots? I don't know. Same here. I did nothing to the bike. I mean, I fell on the other side and the other side is not <laughs> that scratched. So, I mean, it is scratched just a little, but come on, Honda, you can do a better paint job on this thing. Uh, it's like this bike is designed to, to buy an aftermarket stuff. Um, I, I guess I covered everything what I wanted to cover today. Well, uh, it's it's a very different experience than than the one that I have on my TRK. So uh, it's a, it's a new chapter for me. I will learn how to ride this dirt bike, uh, and hopefully you will stick around to see how I manage to do that. Because as I said, I consider myself a noob uh, or a beginner, and hopefully with the skills that I acquired uh, last season and, and during this season, riding on a TRK, it's, it's gonna be a bit easier for me. But uh, still, I, I think there's a lot to learn. So that's what I'm, what, what I will try to do. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe I will still ride a little today, but uh, it's very hot.